Yeah. There's been other situations where you don't have a shell, but maybe you have standard error and standard out of mm -hmm. the main program that's running. And that's super helpful too, That if it's, if it's writing that out to the console. And there's been situations where I've had a binary protocol that I was reverse engineering and it would write its logs to the console. So I could have Claude send payloads yep. And then monitor yep. over the network, and it could literally monitor, you know, the, mm -hmm. the, res the results, the error messages that were being generated. And so it was able to craft eventually a successful payload. Yeah, that's awesome. And I love it. Like, we would still explore the command line ourselves, but it's kind of nice. Like, you know, you get dropped into some of these limited shells or bootloaders or whatever. And you're like, well, like, what is this? And what are the commands do I have at my disposal? LMs are really great at like, hey, I get this command prompt. Like, go try a bunch of stuff and tell me as much as you can about it. Right? The prompt could probably be just <laughs> like that because you just let it go. 